the amazing powers of the ant hills, the amazing spiritual benefits of the ant hills, the mysterious spiritual benefits of the ant hills. This ant hill you are seeing here is one of the mysterious wonders of nature in the sense that it is a mystery how little little ants, though they may be up to 250 to 300,000 inside that their house, can, can build a big house like this. And it sometimes is so big that it is even bigger than you, taller than you in size, and they inhabit there comfortably, goes to fetch their food and eat. You know, I have made mention of it when I was talking about how to stop drunkenness and how to also cure madness permanently. You can check through my channel if you in this channel to find it out. By God's grace, I want to make an extensive video more about ant hill because the thing is that this ant hill have even up to 200 spiritual benefits, both negative and positive things it does. But I am not here to tell you anything about negative, but only positive. So, Follow me to the end of this video. Let us unravel this mystery. Welcome once again to Jenny Action TV. In this particular channel, I discuss three important variables which are actually health, safety, and spirituality. Believe me, if you can understand and apply this three correctly in your life, there is no limit to your achievement. If this is the very first time you're landing in this channel, you're highly welcome. Please do it to hit the red subscribe button and the bell notification so that YouTube will always notify you once I upload a new video. For my returning subscribers, Subscribers, thank you so much. I love you for always stopping by for all your comments, for all your thumbs up. I really appreciate you. May God honor you. For if you are my new timers, please go through my channel. You must see one or two videos that will help you and lift up your spirit in any situation you find yourself. So without wasting time, let's quickly get into the video proper. See, for those that are Christians, the Bible actually recorded in the book of John 21, verse 20 to 25, that if every miracle that Jesus has done on this earth is recorded in the scripture, the whole world will not contain it. And that same Bible actually says that the miracle he, he did, we will do more. And believe me, nature did not leave us empty handed. He gave us everything we needed to perform that miracle on a platter of good. Believe me, ant hill is one of the weapon on his, or instrument that nature has left for us to perform lots and lots of miracles. But there is one thing about it. If there is no ant in any ant hill, it will not work. Again, when I'm talking of ant hill, I'm not talking of those small, small things that ant build. We are talking of mountain hill. Those ones that used to be big, even bigger than human beings, that if you check, you will see that it is always built in the forest, but it's not located deep in the forest. It is always at the outskirts. It's unfortunate that because of development, a lot of these things are no longer seen. But for the fact that very soon we are traveling to a village, so that in case you see it in your village, you can actually use it to perform the wonders you need before coming back and your life will transform. Now, the first thing I'm going to be teaching you is how you can use it to bless your children, to correct any misbehavior in your children, and make your children to be extremely successful even as they grow and grow up. How do you do this? All you need to do is to get a cowry or get something like a coin and then go straight to wherever this ant hill is located, basically around that kind 6 p.m. So when you get there, offer is like you are giving offering to the ant hill. Let me tell you, everything you see existing on this earth, there is a spirit supporting it. So, and that same spirit that God has released, so long as they are there, is like accepting that offering. Let me put it this way. I like to be plain to people. Once you drop it, fetch some sand from that particular ant hill and then go and get a new bucket not the bucket you have ever been using in your house and put that enough sand you fetch then pour water on it let the water fill that particular bucket and then pray on it all the blessings you want for your children if they are stubborn that god will stop stubbornness if they you want them to live very long longevity you pray riches wealth influences government powers, anything you want them to occupy and have when they have grown, pray it. Then, every day as they want to bet, that is where you'll be fetching water to bet them. You, you, you fetch out that water and you add a new water. You fetch out that because the sand will settle on the bottom of that pocket. Do it consistently seven good days, morning and night. Each time they're batting in the morning, from that bucket, each time they're batting in the night, from that bucket, allow that water to dry in their body. If their body is dirty, of course, it will be because they are children. You should bet them separate first with soap 
water and sponge and other things you need to bed them then bring this one and bed the last morning and night allow the water to dry in their body with your cleaning their body believe me that your children will become untouchable spiritually no power will be able to manipulate them anywhere they go doors will be open unto them you will live and enjoy the good fortunes that they will bring it that is number one thing ant hill does another thing that ant hill does is if you are doing business and your business is not doing well, maybe your business is doing well before and suddenly it started scattering, believe me, you can use that ant hill to gather your business together and make it to grow. And also, if money doesn't stay in your hand, with the help of ant hill, you will gather plenty of money that will remain. How do you do this? You actually need three coconuts to do it. You get three coconuts like this. If possible, go and uh, get that coconut from the coconut tree. Look for somebody that has coconut. Let it not touch the ground when you bring it. And then that's when it falls. Let it not hit the ground. Then when you get that particular coconut, you remove the outer back remaining like this. So what do you do? One, you will use one for seven days. You get one of it like this. And then use sharp object to open it from the third eye third eye don't break it if you break it it will not work open it very well from the third eye get a basin like this or something that is even bigger and they pour the water so when you finish pouring make sure you get the one that have enough water then you get this honey just look at the quantity of that particular water of coconut and measure the commensurate quantity just use your eyes to size it and measure the commensurate quantity and mix it very well inside that particular coconut water then go straight to the ant hill and then fetch part of the sand of the ant hill from the body of that ant hill and also add it here then mix all of them very well together use it and pray that oh god my heavenly father that as this ant money to build this particular a kind of house like this that so shall you build my business and it will be a mystery to people how it will begin to blossom and money will begin to stay in my hand i'll gather money that i don't even understand how i was able to make such a month of money then after you have done this then you store this each time you want to bet bet your normal bed with soap and water then mix part of this uh, a kind of mixture in another basin because you are going to use this particular one for seven days use uh, your eyes to divide it for uh, for seven times then get one portion and use it as a rinsing bed then after this one finish you prepare the second coconut that will last for seven days prepare the third one you need this work for 21 days believe me after 21 days hey hey people that knows you before will not know you the way your business will be booming if that business is not the best for you your eyes will open to a better business you'll be doing and then the way you start gathering money just as it's a mystery how this ant small ant can build this house that is how, with the way it will even chalk you and chalk people that knows you that is another benefit of ant sale Another benefit is that, you know, before I have actually talked about how it cures madness, I'm going to teach you another way you can actually use it to cure madness. How do you do it? You still need coconut. Believe me, coconut have lots and lots of amazing benefits that if you understand it, you can actually go and have coconut plantation. You need it. I'm telling you the truth. Coconut is this year. Now that we are getting close to the end of the year and you actually want to travel, leaving your house, Coconut is the easiest thing you use to suck spirit because when the house is abandoned for some time, from seven days and above, spirit can actually come and occupy it. But when you get that coconut, the one that you have not removed the bag, and was able to put to a kind of um, hang it inside that your house, and even outside if you wish, believe me, no spirit will be able to come and occupy it. But that's story for another day. Let's begin to talk about what we are saying. Now, when you get this coconut, then you open it from the third eye as usual don't open it unless it's from the third eye you pour it inside here then after you must have poured it inside the basin get salt you get salt just one spoon of salt and mix inside then get there is something like this we call it unsalted calabash this one is salted calabash. This one is actually edible. That one salted most of the time is not edible. It used to be big and triangular form that the color is like this. 
most of the times it is native doctors that use it. They use it to draw circle in their eyes like this so that they will be seeing mistress. Because uh, for somebody that is mad, you see that person also sees mistress, sees spirit. Most of them is even maybe they are trying to open their third eyes and then along the line, they begin to see the things they can see. They see much more than they can, that spirit can get and they get mad. Another thing is if it's spiritual projection. So the madness I'm talking about now is majorly for spiritual projection. Now, it's not just madness, even epileptic patient, if you do the same thing, it is going to work for that person. So how do you do? You now get that one that they used to draw circle. If, if you go to any spiritual shop and explain, they will get, give it to you. Then you get something like sharp object like this and scrape a, 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 some of it, like the full teaspoons of salt you have put. Then when you scrape it, you put your right middle finger and begin to pray that God in his infinite mercy will heal this particular person of any form of madness, wherever this madness is coming from, that you're putting it and sending it back to the sender, that as this person uses it to wash his or her face and also wash his or her head, that this person will become free. So what do you do? After that, let the mad person use it to wash his face, use it to wash his head. Believe me, that spirit of madness will run away. Now, to perfect that particular procedure, take that mad person straight to that particular ant hill. When the person reach there, let the person urinate in one of the holes. Then you see ants will rush to come and lick that urine. Then you start going home. When you get home, then get back this unsalted calabash not this one this one is edible that and tongue is not edible this one you can eat it is salty in uh, this in salty in taste but that one is not salted that's why i call it unsalted calabash get it let that person eat it but not to swallow let that person because that time the person will start getting his or her himself but if he did not go there first and come the person may not get it if you ask him to eat it he will swallow it not that it will do anything to that person no but it will you will not get the perfect result let that person eat it and then spit it three times as he eat it and shoot it spit it three times immediately he finish spitting it on the sand three times that spirit of madness at once we jump just as it's a mystery how ant was able to build that house that is how it will be a mystery how that person is cured permanently. That's another amazing power of the ant heal. Somebody has actually asked me to make video on how to heal stroke patient. Believe me, ant heal is the easiest way to heal stroke patient and heal any sickness that seems that it is unending, that is very difficult to be healed. How do you do it? Somebody has been sick, you are taking that person to hospital, different places, and the person is not getting well, and you yourself, you are sick, you are sure that you're, you have not gotten your body, something is wrong with you. You don't have anything to worry about. If only you can find this type of ant heal I'm explaining. Simply go straight to the ant heal, and then when you get there, then use your right hand, use your right hand and hit that ant here three times, praying that God will use it to heal you. When you are going, cook white rice, mix it with sugar, and they pour it there if you are the one, and pour it in the tray of the hole. Now hit it three times, make your wish and go. How that sickness will disappear is a mystery. But if you are going to be doing it for somebody, just do the same thing. Then use your right hand and pack the sand of that ant here. Then when you come back to where that person is, you because it's the sand that will help you, you now transfer that sand inside that inside your left hand and use your right hand to hold the right hand of that person and start praying. Within five minutes, that sickness will be over. That is another way. The same thing is applicable to if somebody is dead. One, that make sure that nobody has cried that place. If somebody has cried, it will not work. Two, let it be that it is below seven minutes. After seven minutes, I used to tell you there is a, a border that demarcated the land of dead and the living. Of death it actually means that you have lived, your spirit have actually left your body and your soul. It's just empty body that will be buried on the ground that is remaining. And you start going to the land of dead. You will discover that for you to cross that particular place to get to the land of dead, it will take you seven minutes. Now, if it is below seven minutes and you're able to get straight to the irrespective of whatever killed of this person, irrespective of whether this, it is the time of the person or not, just this is a mystery of how God made it possible that we can actually raise the dead. So, you rush straight 
and go to that ant hill, use your right hand and fetch the sun and come back once it's below seven minutes and nobody has cried because if somebody has cried, it will not work. The person will go finally. Then you transfer the same sun into your left hand, use that right hand and hold the right hand of that person, make your prayers that this person will come back to life. Believe me, in your own very eyes, you'll be shocked that person will come back to life. If somebody is a chain smoker and you actually want to end it or into any form of drug addiction, especially using Indian hemp, the easiest way to stop you permanently is simply and to heal. Just get three sticks. I've talked about it before. Three sticks that the person has smoked and then go there and drop it in the three holes. Go in there with you, different types of seven uh, cereals and it is over. Just get to the other of my video where I've talked about it. You will see more. God, by God's grace, I'll pin it in this particular one. Then another thing is that if you desire to be extremely rich, influential, whatever it is you desire in your life, if you can find this ant hill and have mind to go there 12 midnight, this one works 12 midnight and it must be the day you are born. That's why people that, that don't know the day they are born, they are missing a lot. Let's say you are born on a Friday or on a Monday, or on a Tuesday, you now get a bottle like this, put different types of cereal in this bottle, like you can get rice, millet, sorghum, beans, in a corn, and the others, so long as it is cereals, those things that aren't feed on, and then you will be able to mix it like the size of this bottle, and they are mixed, different types of it are mixed. And then you carry it there as an offering and go to the ant hill. All you need to do there is to stand and pray and make your intention. As soon as you finish making your intention that you want to be rich, you want to be extremely successful, you want to be a preacher, you want to become a celebrity, you want to buy a car, you want to buy house, this and that, your business, you want it to go global, whatever it is that you need, then you now pour it into different four holes of the ant, if possible, the one that is located in east, west, north, and south. Then when you finish pouring it, just go your way. Give it four moons. I give you four moons. He that don't know you before will not know you again because your life will become a shock and a mystery. That particular thing you have prayed will suddenly come to pass. And then if you have a shitting spouse and you want that shitting spouse to stop it permanently, the ant heel is the easiest way to do it. How do you do it? Just get the underwear of that person, either pants or boxers, whether it's the woman or man or whosoever, and go straight to the ant heel, carrying your rice mixed with sugar, enough cooked rice mixed with sugar. When you get there, make your prayers, make your intention known, then put inside the four holes of that ant heel those rice, and then carry that underwear and simply put inside it inside one of the holes and go your way. That man will never ever look at any other woman again. That woman will also never never look at any other man again. And that person becomes yours and yours forever. How the person will suddenly stop becomes a mystery. If you feel that causes are following you, until is the easiest way to get rid of those causes. Just the same way you mix the one you use to bless your children. Mix it very well and then pray on it that all these causes, lack of child, everything you needed, not giving birth, no hammering, everything that is your problem, you now speak it into that water, use it as a rinsing bath for seven days. All those causes will break permanently. Whether somebody costs you, you cost yourself, it's inherited from generation, whatever it is, it will break permanently. You wish to get married, the same way you, the person that wants to get rich actually prepares his soul, or get rich and influential prepares his soul. It's what you will do within four months, you will just marry the man of your choice. There's no limit to what Aunt Hill will do. If I begin to talk about it, this video will be extremely long. And because of those that have been complaining that my video used to be long, I am so... There are lots and lots of spiritual benefits and also you have lots and lots of negative. There is a way you use it, you kill somebody, you paralyze somebody, you make somebody to go to an exile and a lot of die consequences. You see these people that somebody went to sleep with somebody's wife and the person's thing sick stick on the other person's pain. I don't want to call some sense name. We are YouTube or YouTube will just buy you. They will not say more than this. So it's teeth. 
one of the easiest way to do it is actually until but because negativity is repulsive to me i don't teach negativity so i will not be able to tell you those ones by god's grace these ones i've told you are one of the most best benefits if you apply it you will be shocked but there is one thing you need to know if until it's located in your land please it's not what you just wake up and destroy it anyhow if you destroy it, there is no project you start in that land that you will be able to finish. You want to build a house, it's not possible, you will not finish. You begin to experience promise and fail, failure at the age of breakthrough, disappointment, backwardness, different types of problems. The only way you can actually destroy it is that, like around that kind 12 midnight, they normally goes out in convoy. When they are almost going out in convoy, you also mix enough rice and sugar for them a little bit from the distance of their house. You can actually do it even from 6 p.m. if they can agree to come out. Once those ants leave that their house and they are struggling to lick your sugar and that's your rice you pour outside of it, you can deliberately put some from the mouth and draw it very outside a little bit far so that they will trace it and pump out. Once they are not here, the spirit doing all these things that is behind them will also depart. You now break that house into pieces. That is the only way you will now become very free and no power will actually hinder you from achieving your success. Failure to do it like this, go and make investigation of those who just destroy ants here anyhow and start building their house if they were able to complete it. So with this, I've actually come to the end of this video, believing that somebody has picked up something. And if you are traveling to village, please search for ants here and use the amazing benefit God deposited there and transform your life. And believe me, your life will never be the same again. So here ends the video. If you find it helpful, please give me a thumbs up. It's very, very important to me. And also, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell notification so that you will get, get my next upload. See your lady Jenny saying bye-bye. God bless you. May the mystery surrounding and see which nobody can explain begin to happen in your life. That your life become a mystery. How you begin to achieve unachievable within a small time of your life. God bless you.